Uh, it's, oh, it's Maureen. Good evening, Your Royal Highness. Good evening, Your Majesty. And now is my favourite presenter of all time. I don't know. Clive's next door watching the football, I think, so uh, I can't quite tell. Are you, <clears throat> sure. Uh, you're going to America, aren't you? Yes, I am, naughty girl. And how long you've got on? Yes, I am. Don't start me off, Ian, because I'm concerned about you. OK. Please don't go America. I have to go America. What for? Work, isn't it? But how I, long? I've not, got, I've not got the visa on my passport back yet, and I don't, I'm not sure uh, I will. They say it'll take I five hope, days. I hope you don't get a visa. Why? Because... Uh, because America's doomed soon. Yes, but isn't it, that's in like six years' time or something, isn't it? I told you that years, well, I told James that seven years ago. Yeah. It's the end of society. Yes. Society's going to break down. Yes, yeah, so you're, you're a, a future seer, aren't you? Visionary. Visionary, yes. Ahead of, uh, ahead of time. Michael Jackson's above his time. He's above his time, but yeah. he can't see ahead of time. What's going to happen to Michael Jackson in the future? Michael Jackson is the future. He's the modern day Jesus Christ. Yes. He's a wonderful human, just like you, Ian. Uh, well, I, I suspect he's more wonderful than me, yes. Yeah. Yes. Ian, yes. come round to when you're not so busy, because you're just up the road from me. You're in Tottenham, aren't you? Tottenham. Yeah, I could pop round and have a jam donut. Well, as long as you fill it with some fresh cream. Ian. I fancy a chocolate finger. Well, you need some butter, filthy boy. Spank me butter, naughty boy. Go on, show us a good time. Look. Thank you, Maureen. Filthy man. Yes. <laughs> what, what happened there? Was you talking about me? <laughs> I don't. I don't know, Chris. I, don't, I've done, I haven't had a clue what's been happening for the whole three hours of this show. Oh. Uh, let's let's go to uh, uh, Maureen. Hello, Maureen. Oh, hi, uh, Ian. Hello, Maureen. Um, <clears throat> my question. Um, sorry, hi guys. She's saying hi. Hello. Yeah, yeah hi. Oh, hi. Yeah. She's so struggling now, with that. You're I'm, going to be screwed I'm for the rest of it. I'm not particularly into your music, but I do like it. I'm glad. Thank and you. I wanted to ask you: Have you ever met Frank Sinatra or <laughs> Elvis Presley? No, they, Elvis Presley passed away when I think when I was seven. Um, oh dear! I yeah, think was, you're a lot older. Yeah, I sound old, but uh, my body feels old, but I'm not that old. And. Uh, but Frank Sinatra, I did actually see him perform once. Did you really? Went, went to see him at Radio City Music Hall in, I think, 1993. Wow. Um, so some would say his, his peak. Well, at that point, he had uh, uh, about eight teleprompters on the stage mm. and still forgot the words to witchcraft. Oh. But it was still, it was great to see him, and uh, and Shirley MacLaine opened up, and she was excellent, too. Fantastic. So was, to be in Radio City Music Hall and see see Frank Sinatra was pretty great. I've met, I've never met him. Costello. I've met Elvis Costello and Elvis Stoiko, a uh, Canadian figure skater yeah. with a bad haircut. <laughs> does, but, that, uh, does that answer your question, Maureen? Oh, no, fine. Are you okay, uh, Ian? Yeah, I'm fine, thank you. I still love you. you know uh, have that. you been a naughty girl? I've been a very naughty girl. Yes? <clears throat> I've done no housework, Ian. Can you spank me bottom? Ian? Yes, Maureen? Give me bottom a good spanking. Okay, I and we have to end it there because then it gets f too filthy wow. to broadcast.